Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maury's Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing. Let's go to the city or Animal Crossing city folk. And we have some ma we have a lot of mail. Oh yes, that's right. We ordered a whole bunch of stuff from Tom Nook. In fact, it's only stuff from Tom Nook. So we probably need to empty our mail out. Um, but you know what? We need to check the turnip prices first, the AM prices before we do that. So we're going to go ahead and quickly do that because we only have like 10 minutes to check this price and then sell our turnips if it's a good price. Yesterday we had 107 and for the AM and 86 for the PM. Um, so not that great. Welcome, please, please browse all you like. We don't have time to browse. Oh, no, I thought that for a second that was a silver fishing rod. No, not that we need one. We have one now. Um, yes, yes, tell me, what can I do for you? Please be really high. Imagine if it was like 600. <laughs> 67, that is terrible. I don't even know what the highest you can get in City Folk is. We've had it in the, like, the 900s in the GameCube version. I think 600s is the highest in New Horizons. Hmm. Oh, well that's okay then. We have a little bit of time to, to waste. Um, for the PM price. I can't imagine it's going to be very high after seeing that. Um, but let's get rid of some of these tools. And our first present. Which is the Cabana 4. Oh, we can't throw anything away whilst we're in the store. We can't litter in the store. Which makes sense, but I love how the game is okay with you just throwing it on the floor outside once you're in town. Always makes me laugh, the, the concept of that. Right, so let's just throw this away then. So what other ones do we not need? Exotic chest. All the Tom Nook ones can be thrown away. Nook. And let's do bug off trophy from Harry. What was this one? Uh, that's so good. Uh, thanks for the great gift. Oh yes, that was just our welcome one, wasn't it? And then we've got the letter from Dad, Happy Home Academy. I think this is just a score one, but it doesn't really matter about uh, Actually, let's just double check that one. Uh, yeah, so we don't need that one either. There we go. So we should be able to go and get all the rest of our stuff. We won't need our umbrella today or our shopping card. Let's sort things out. There we go. Making making space. I, I swear this should just be called Alma Crossing Tidy Town. Or Tidying Town. That's what it should be called because we're always tidying and arranging things and cleaning things up. There we go. So this is, we just emptied our mailbox. This is just all going to be stuff that we ordered from Tom Nook. A bunch of Cabana stuff. And I think that's pretty much it actually. So get all these out. Just enough room. I have to read them all so we can get in there. So we got the Cabana dresser, the Cabana wardrobe. All this stuff is just going straight in our basement, basically. Cabana table. I think we pretty much ordered everything that we're able to, apart from the beds. I think we just didn't we didn't order the beds. The vanity there, and the Cabana screen. So we can put some things back that we don't need to, well, for now anyway. Put those in there. Watering can probably will need. Let's take a long time to organize things. <laughs> Especially with the Wii remote. Sometimes I do feel like it takes a little bit longer than if we just had a normal controller. But I've definitely warmed to the Wii remote. Uh, one of the reasons, if I've said this before, but in case you're new, one of the reasons I never really played City Folk before was because I always assumed you had to walk around by pointing, like if I point to here, I'll walk over and you're forever like picking things up and it's quite awkward, but you don't actually have to. You can just use the nunchuck and it's, so it's like using half a controller. I had no idea that was the case. And so for so long, I never really gave it a chance. Okay, we can finally get rid of this uh, Triforce flooring in favor of our Cabana. Ooh, I don't know if I like this. It kind of looks cool. Uh, oh, we've already got a wardrobe. Well, 
else have we got? <laughs> no, we must. Why have we got two wardrobes? <laughs> Um, we're not really arranging it as such at the moment. So we might as well just drop everything out. Um, there we go. We could put something in the dresser here maybe. We want to make it look a little bit presentable. Just so it's not super messy. But at the same time we don't want to spend too long. Like, Because we're not going to decorate it. Um, we have this, a screen as well. There we go. Um, and what was the last one? Cabana bookcase. There we go. Actually, looks really cozy in here already, but this it also looks kind of messy because there's just too much cabana stuff going on. So we do need more exotic furniture. We need more like bushy trees and plants and that that we're going to try and get. Um, yeah, I'm not sure I go much on the cabana floor. Maybe we could use the exotic floor if we could ever come across it. And eventually when we start decorating, we'll have to get rid of the master sword and the triforce, of course. But for now, we just have that on display because they're cool. And because why not? Okay, so uh, they're all in place, ready for when we decorate. I do think we need a couple more exotic pieces. Uh, maybe there's one in, in nooks today, who knows? I'm surprised we haven't unlocked more of that though. In the GameCube version, the exotic pieces are normally quite common. Right, let's get our... Um, oh, did I put it away? We need to water our turnip. I can never remember where I put things. There we go. So it's just a few minutes probably until midday. But our trees are growing here. So we're going to put a path up here eventually. Um, in fact, we could probably do that now. I'm really in the mood for a new path design as well. Kind of the, the Triforce has got it old now. So if anyone has any ideas, please let me know. Well, for now, this definitely will uh, be, be fine. Because whatever we do, we'll replace this design anyway, so we won't have to redo the paths or anything. I guess this is going to be like a little bit of a viewing area. Uh, should we go more than that or... Yeah, I think we could go over to here, couldn't we? Like this. Oh, it's noon! Not that it feels like it, the weather's very grey. It feels like it's about 6 o'clock in the evening. Um. There we go, just finish up. Ah! Finish up this new path. It's not really leading anywhere. Um, it's just kind of leading up to our golden shovel spawning area. I think we'll end it here. There we go. Uh, it's just kind of a bit of a viewing area, I guess. Nothing too special. But it kind of adds a bit of character, gives us something to do. I don't know if I like it that close to the river. But I suppose... It's, yeah, I suppose that's okay, isn't it? It's either that or bring it up to this tree and then remove this entire... line like that. Um... There's 
Is it better like this? Or is it better with it there and away from the tree? Let me know. Well, do you like this version, which we'll call A? Or do you like the version we had a minute ago, which we'll call B? Where we had it against the river. Let me know. A or B? A like this or B next to the river? Have a vote and whichever one wins, we will change it accordingly. Right, let's go. Oh, hey, Harry. Better talk to you, hadn't we? Even though you moved in right behind us. Skippy, good to see you. You could have, uh, couldn't have wandered over at a better time. Oh, why? What's what's going on? Say, Skippy, are you into wilderness survival games? When I've got free time, I go out into the wild and train and hone my survival skills. One thing I do is get some buddies to hide in the deep shadows and I go after them. Then I track down the prey of uh, uh, friends to win the game. You want to try? I'll let you be the hunter. Okay. Apollo's waiting patiently for something. Maybe he wants to play. Uh, okay, I think we're going to be playing hide and seek. They always surprise you with hide and seek. It's always out of the blue. Totally random. You stay away from my turnips. Okay, then it's a pretty simple game. We'll hide and you find us in 10 minutes. You win! Okay, we know the rules. Okay, let's go. So we've got... Oh, who was the other one? Gaston, Harry. And there was some small villager that I didn't see. Probably a sheep. Okay, no one down here. This also gives us a good chance just to chill out and try and find the uh, fossils as well. Looks like all the flowers were revived. Oh, hey. Oh, I wonder where Harry could be. Where is he? Hello. <laughs> Find you first. You're the worst hider ever. How did you defeat my ninja stealth haze? My skills must be getting dull in my old age. Another villager that just keeps saying they're old. How old are they? Hey, you know there are two others around uh, you haven't found yet, right? Yes. Um, so let's see if we can find them. I wish the clock would disappear. The stopwatch. Like how the normal clock does, it's quite distracting when you're trying to scour the ground for fossils. We mustn't forget to check the turnip prices. Hey, Felbert. Uh, I see you. What? How did you uh, defeat my ninja stealth? Well, clearly you guys are getting trained by the wrong ninja. The trouble is, we don't know who we're looking for now. I think it must have been a sheep. Because they're quite small. Always have to look behind the houses. But they can hide behind trees as well, as we know. Okay, let's go check our new area. Make sure I'm not hiding up here behind any trees. Here's a fossil. May as well dig them up. Oh, it's a gyro! May as well dig them up while we see them. A mega, a me mega sproid. Um, can't see anyone. Oh, yes, this tree is growing, so we can get rid of this. That is the tiniest stump ever! <laughs> and we can plant another money tree. It's our last one. There we go. Ah! <gasps> Oh, it's a good job we were here. I would have never have seen you. Okay. Uh, hey, Wendy. I wonder where Wendy could be. It is Wendy, isn't it? Wendy, where are you? There you are. 
Uh, Muffins, you got me! I feel like I've been ravaged by Moriland Ninja or something. You're really good. Yeah, we were trained by the right ninja, you see. In fact, we are the master ninja. The only ninja. Uh, way to um, seek, Beach Bomb. I gotta be straight with you. I didn't think you had a chance. Here, have a Rhythmoid. You deserve a little something. Oh, thanks. I don't know if we have a Rhythmoid. I don't know this victory. Go to your head. Everyone gets lucky sometimes. Next time, it might be me. Yes, actually, we were quite lucky because if we'd have just checked and then ran away, we'd never have seen Wendy behind that tree there. Right, let's go and check the turnip prices. Um, it's always fun to do hide and seek anyway, but I do. I find it weird that the prize is a gyroid because when it rains, especially in like June when it's the rainy season, you get a bunch of gyroids, so it's just weird. I mean, it's probably good during the winter when you don't get so many, maybe. Uh, or maybe you do because of the snow. Maybe it would be better in, like, um, like autumn? 62 is going down. No. That is not good. Okay, right. We need a couple of these trees because we're... Um, thanks for the feedback in the comments. I'm going to go and plant these by the rocks. Um... The last money rocks that don't have trees next to them. There we go. And we'll just double check the stuff upstairs. Never know, there might be a cabana item or something. Oh, lovely vanity. Have we got a lovely vanity? A candle. It's like the first item you get in the game. Uh, let's see, so we've got the vanity, lovely vanity we're looking for, make sure we've got that. Um, lovely love seat, dresser, dresser, armoire, chair, love seat, table, vanity, we do have it. In fact, we have a lot of stuff. Uh, what's this? Is that um, a ranch item? Ah, oh, yes, that's the. Oh, it's just a writing desk. No thanks. Right, we'll check the carpets because if we've got the exotic rug here. Cabana flooring! <laughs> what are the chances? Uh, the round carpet. What does that look like? Ooh, I kind of like the round carpet. I think we've probably already got it there. It looks familiar. That's... No, 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 no. Okay. We must have clicked the round carpet last time. Let's... This one here. Oh, the slate flooring is in there every day. Okay, I don't think we need anything from here. Have we got this? Is it a go board? Oh, the shogi board. Yeah, we've got that one, haven't we? And the sledge we've got, the cooker we've got, the table. Pretty sure we've got all this. So we don't need any of that. But we will buy the flowers, of course, because we, we still are healing the, the grass. We're trying to, anyway. I think the grass is slowly defeating us, but we're getting there a little bit. Um... We'll buy them. We do lose a couple of flowers a day, I think. If we don't notice them withered or wilted. I never know what the correct term is. There we go. Oh, we can't carry anymore. We don't need the golden shovel anymore. Or the axe. Or the watering can. There we go. We'll take the last couple of flowers and then we'll go and plant these trees. And we're going to go and get a town um, rating today because we've planted so many trees and all they ever say is it needs more trees or it, it feels like it could mean we need more trees. <laughs> so, I don't know. Let's get our shovel out. And we're going to put a tree. This has been a popular suggestion for a while. We should have done it by now, to be honest. 
Um, but the only place we can really put a tree is here. We could put it in front of it, but I don't think that would grow, actually. So we're going to put one here. Hopefully that grows there. It will also help the grass a bit as well. Yeah, we're trying to heal this bit because this bit does look... Um, very messy. In fact, we could... Put one here as well. There we go. And that should really help to heal that area there. I can't wait till the, all the grass is back to normal, but part of me thinks it never will, because as soon as you fix one bit, another bit needs working on. Uh, right, we need to go and plant the other tree. Well done, Harry, for using the paths. Good for you. These ones. Oh! <gasps> no way! No way, no way! No way, I've waited so long for this. I had no idea this was possible. Hey! Can we get a thumbnail? This is Caitlyn. I've never experienced Caitlyn. Oh, I think we're going to have to try and travel back to Mirkwood. I need Kate, uh, is it Katie or Caitlyn? One of you. I need you to turn around. <laughs> Caitlyn, oh dear, my daughter has wandered off. Wherever could she be? Is it possible we got separated in Mirkwood? Wait, do we have to take you to Mirkwood or does Sunny have to bring Katie here? Tell me more, tell me more. Um, Pickles, wherever could she have gone? Little darling naughty kitten. Uh, oh, have we got, there's a new bug here as well. I can't believe Caitlin is in our town. No, oh, we scared it away. It's funny, like, Caitlin is, like, holding a spatula for some reason. You've been cooking, like, pancakes or something. Caitlin, you really... We need, we, we need a good thumbnail. Um, do we have to take you to Katie, or... Oh, she's always been such a, a willful kitten. Oh, I think Sunny needs to bring Katie here. I'll have to... I'll have to reach out to Sunny so they can bring, um, Kate, uh, Katie back. Caitlin just doesn't doesn't want a screenshot. She doesn't want her photo taken. Oh, that's super exciting. That technically you can't get those two characters anymore, Katie or Caitlin, because the servers are turned off. You can only get them from doing the using the fan servers, which is how we travel towns these days. And uh, so it's so good. Oh, it's oh, it's made me really happy. Um, okay, what were we doing? <laughs> we need to find our shovel and plant this tree here. I think we can just do it right behind it, can't we? Um, okay. Yeah, so Sunny's gonna have to bring Katie to, back to Moriland to get a reward. It doesn't look like to me that we can take Caitlyn to, um, to that town. Oh, Pickles! What's a mama cat to do? I wonder if she's in Mirkwood. Wait, does that, does that mean we have to travel to Mirkwood, or...? I feel like she's looking at me for answers and I don't know. I, I think it's Katie you have to take to Caitlyn. If I remember. Don't worry, Caitlyn, we will sort this out. We will sort it out. Anyway, what are we doing? I'm so lost now, I'm so uh, sidetracked. Let's tidy up some stray flowers. So we get our bearings. Um, oh, that's right. We were searching for fossils and gyroids. That's so cool. It's so hard to see uh, those kind of special characters these days. And it's weird to me that we've actually seen Caitlyn before we've seen... Miss um, Gulliver. <laughs> so weird. 
Gaston, hey. Oh, Careful, there's a, there's a random cat running around. Oh, Pookie, it's afternoon. Do you think that's why they call it afternoon? Um, nah, it's just coincidence. So, pal, are you the type of guy who makes a priority to check out town events? Uh, when I have to. Yeah, you bet I am. Definitely. Well, aren't you the party human? That's good. You've got to keep up with the rest of the town's folk. For any of the big events, do yourself a favour and chat with some of the veteran partiers. I'd wager they've got a thing or two to teach you about having a good time, hybrids. Oh. So actually, we could probably get the money rock as well, couldn't we? Not this one. I think I'm just so bad at seeing fossils. Uh, let's do uh, holes here so we don't disturb the tree. Not this one. Run away from Filbert! Actually, we should double check over here in case we walk past any fossils. It's so hard to spot them. We haven't had a... Wait, oh no, you don't get bottles on the beach, do you, in this game? I was about to say, we haven't had a bottle. But that's a wild world thing, isn't it? Which we will play at some point, by the way. Wild world is on the uh, to-do list. We want to make sure we're well and truly over um, City Folk when, when we play that, because they're quite similar games. Nope, nothing down here. How are you looking suspicious? Hmm. We also need to dedicate some time to sorting our fruit trees out. I don't know whether to have them like this and have orchards, or whether to kind of spread them out a little bit and... Just make them look more natural and in the wild. So if you have any ideas, please let me know. Hey, Wendy. Whoops. Uh, oh, more, I got problems. My catch rate is like so last decade. I need something bright and happy and bright. Or whatever. Uh, just change it for me, please. No sweat. Uh, okay, something bright and happy. How about we call it... It's Sunny after Sunny from Merkwood. Do we have an emoji for a sun? Is there emojis here somewhere? <gasps> no emojis. We do have a star though. Nice. Uh, I'm Wendy. I want to thank my mum and dad and all of my lovely fans, Sunny. Tee that's gonna work great when I win Little Miss Lasagna Pageant. L Wait, did I read that right? Las lasagna was that? Maybe I read that wrong. <laughs> Let's try getting the rock from this side. Let the grass heal. Only two gyros. We've not found a single fossil. Oh, I can't believe Kate, Caitlin's in our town. That's crazy. Never would have expected that. It's so rare. And because we travel so little, I was not expecting that at all. Where are the fossils? Uh, please don't tell me this is the, uh, the money rock. Whew. It means it's this one all the way over here. Oh, I just saw one. Ah, another gyroid. Oh, uh, we haven't done the rock down by the ramp, have we? I think that's the last rock that we need to do. We got too distracted by Caitlyn. If 
it's not this one. I don't know what's going on. There we go. It's this one. Don't think you're going to find Katie staring at a cliff. I'm not going to lie. No doubles again. We need the money. I think even if we double our money, we're only going to get uh, 200,000 bells. We're going to need to play the turnips again. Um... 8,001. Right, is there anywhere that we can plant the last cedar tree? Uh, pickles! Where could she have gone, little darling naughty kitten? Don't worry. It'll be fine. It would be cool if we had Katie at some point as well, because then we'll be able to take Katie to another town. Uh, what am I looking for again? Somewhere to put a cedar tree. I think this area is all filled up, isn't it, basically? Seems like a good place. Plant that one. Um... Actually, we don't need to carry any tools. That's it, isn't it? So we're going to have to keep our turnips. If anyone knows a way to stop them spoiling, please let me know. <laughs> oh, another bug. Another new bug. In the, in, the, in the garden shop. Finally. I caught a violin beetle and the world's tiniest violin plays a sad song. That's just terrible. So we didn't find any fossils, but we found three gyroids. So we might as well go and give Blathers the violin beetle before we accidentally sell it. And we can check with Brewster about the gyroids. And after this episode, I'm going to go and reach out to Sunny to see if they're available to come and bring Katie to Moriland. I beg your pardon, I'm a bit of a night owl. Um, here we go, donation. Violin beetle. Lathas always freaks out so much. Oh, I have a message. <laughs> Sunny, Cara Lee, Sunny from Mirkwood uh, has got Katie. So Katie needs to come back to Moriland. Okay, uh, do we have anything else to donate? No, let's go to, just double check the um, gy gyros with Brewster. Um, oh, we've got Cap'n in here as well. Um, please store my gyroid. We'll just check them anyway. Um, I don't have a lot of space here. So oh, it's a duplicate. Uh, why not? We'll do another one then. We can sell what we don't need, of course. We've got no real use for gyroids inside our house. Um, also... Don't forget, if you can travel on the Wii and City Folk and you want to visit town or you want uh, to do a town tour, let me know and we can visit your town as well. I'd love to visit more towns, so let me know if you can do that with your Wii. Oh, so all three of these were... A Sproid, Rhythmoid and a Lamentoid. Hey, Captain! Nice to see you out of the bus. What happens if we go get the bus now? You've got to run to the bus station. Um, yeah, fancy seeing you again. You're always uh, surfacing around here, nibbling for your couple, the Joe. I can't. I cannot speak, Captain, at all. Um, you're a persistent little swigfish. I'll give you. What's a swigfish? Uh, perhaps, uh, perhaps you don't be knowing this, but good coffee be best enjoyed with a few slices of cucumber. Why does Kappa just sound drunk? I feel like. Ah, uh, oh yeah, I, I, I can <laughs> chug fish. I can't even read this. That be common knowledge among real lovers of the old coffee bean. Whatever, whatever, whatever you say, Captain. What, whatever you say. Okay, so. 
I'm gonna go and open the gates and hopefully um, Sunny can bring Katie. This is so cool. This is all happening while I'm recording. This is just amazing. So we're gonna go and get the gates open. Hopefully Sunny can bring over Katie and reunite with Caitlin. This is actually kind of good because if I shut the Wii down or something, I don't know if Caitlin stays in our town. Um, it's kind of cool to have another character wandering around though. So let's see if we can open our gates. Um, talk to Copper. A very good day to you. I see you're making the most of the day. At any rate, is there something I can do for you? Uh, invite guests in. I understand I should start opening the gate process at once so that you can host guests. Okay, there we go. So the gate's opening. And it should take a few minutes. Now connecting to the Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. Without further ado, I will open the gate. Yes, I like it when it works first time. <laughs> sometimes, uh, especially with the fan servers, it, it just doesn't always connect. So sometimes you have to try it a few times. But this is really cool. So we're just gonna wait patiently now. I hope, uh, oh, grasshopper. I hope Caitlin's still where she was. This is gonna be so cool to see Katie. What a treat to see Katie and Caitlin in the same episode after what, 140, what is it, 142 episodes? Um, so yeah, we're just gonna wait now for Sunny to arrive. I don't know if they're ready or not, but we'll leave the gate open anyway. And we just may as well double check all of our flowers are still okay, I think. It rained yesterday, so none of them should be withered. Um, I've just had a thought, with the more trees we plant, the, the harder it's going to be to get the free furniture from the trees. Let's just go and see if Caitlin is still down here somewhere. Um. <gasps> no, where did she go? <laughs> Oh no, we've lost Caitlyn. <laughs> okay, we'll have a bit of a run round because, oh, there's a star. I feel like we're on the clock now. Because Sunny will be here any second. Another gyroid. Oh, here's another one. This must be a fossil. Yeah, we found four gyroids. I didn't think that many spawn per day. I thought we checked this area, but obviously not. Oh dear, where did Caitlyn go? May oh, no, that's Gaston. What are you doing in a corner? Oh, looks like someone's here. So Sunny's arrived with Katie, except now we've lost Caitlyn. So I don't know who exactly where Caitlyn's gone, but I think you have to literally take Katie to Caitlyn. Uh, this is a real tree. Sunny should get a reward from Katie as well. I don't think we get a reward, unfortunately. Sunny has come over, saving in progress. So this is really exciting. This is literally all happening. Pure lucky timing. Oh, look, there's little Katie. Very sweet, mummy. Oh, there's Caitlyn. Caitlyn's ran off to the gate. Sniff, sniff. Oh, where have you been? Sniff, snort, bah! <laughs> oh, they're reunited. Oh, goodness sakes, always wandering off. Are you the kind-hearted soul who brought her back to me? Oh, thank you so very much. I really can't express how truly grateful I am. Uh, Katie, you naughty kitten. So, say thank you to the nice person. Oh, oh don't be sad, saddest face ever. Sniff, thank you. I'm just glad they're reunited. Well, I suppose we should be heading. I must thank you again. Um, mm -hmm. a true angel. Bye bye. Oh, is that it? They're off. Oh, are they going to be hanging around in Moriland now? Are we go are we going to get to see them? Or is that is that it now? Have they gone until the next time? Let's go see. I don't think they would have. Did they come out of the gate? I mean, technically, they must still be in Moriland. Um, <laughs> hey. My keyboard's ran out of battery, so I'm gonna have to type it. Hi. <laughs> uh, send. I'll just put, that was cute. Oops. 
That was cute. Kitty's reunited, yes. It was such a sweet little interaction. It's such a nice thing for them to have put in the game. Um, I think, did you get a prize? Did you get a prize? Or maybe they mail them actually, and maybe we get one as well. Um, did you get a prize? <laughs> Uh, just a, a sniffly thank you. Question mark? Oh, maybe it's mailed then. Uh, maybe they mail something. Oh. We'll put. Yeah. Very. Very sweet. Okay, I get. I don't know. Does Sunny maybe want to come and do something? I didn't prepare any games. <laughs> Uh, maybe you want to visit Nooks. Uh, want. Oops. Ah, I can't type. It's so hard without a keyboard. Want to visit. Nooks. Oh. <laughs> See, this is why it takes so long to have a conversation. Of course. We can't even do a smiley face quickly. Um, I'm just gonna say, feel free to run around. Um, oops. Oopsie. Feel free to explore. Feel free to explore. Um, I think that's everything that I need to do though. Um, so we'll probably wrap it up there actually. I think for the episode that's as much as that we need to do. Sunny's going to go off and do some shopping. And we have successfully somehow reunited Caitlin and Katie. Which is super hard to do in, uh, in modern times. Because the Nintendo servers don't exist anymore. So it's technically impossible to get them. So it's only thanks to the fan servers that you can actually get these characters now. Um, so yeah, that was really exciting and a huge surprise. That's definitely made the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and it's just pure chance that Sunny was also online at the same time we were recording this. So that worked out really, really well. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed seeing Katie and Caitlin. And tomorrow we'll carry on with the usual daily tasks. Check out the turnip prices and things like that. Um, and don't forget if you want to visit or want a town tour or anything like that, let me know. Um, you can always reach out on Discord or through the community tab for channel members. And let me know and maybe we can arrange something that would be awesome. Thank you so much for watching and thank you, a huge thank you of course to the channel members because without you, we couldn't do it without you. So thank you so much and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!